Hi, I'm Jacob Gagan. Hi, my name's Ben Wright. I'm Diego Silvers. I'm Tristan Foster. And we are the founders at Coastal Ice Palace. The Coastal Ice Palace would bring the possibility of playing ice hockey or going skating to the Myrtle Beach area. Currently, the Coastal Ice Hockey team has to drive about two hours every time they want to skate or practice. The Coastal Ice Palace would remove this drive and it would also give a new experience playing ice hockey on the beach. Our business aims to target customer service, making sure that the customer is in the best hands possible, also have, having the best experience possible. And we aim to partner up with local colleges or high schools so that they can play at our rink and then expand junior leagues and see if they're willing to expand to the Myrtle Beach area. The problem with the Myrtle Beach area is that it's growing very quickly and filling up with thousands of northerners. Hockey has grown in popularity in the south, so this fast growing area creates an, a great business opportunity. Currently, there are zero ice rinks in the Conway Myrtle Beach area. This creates a problem for schools such as Coastal Carolina with a club hockey team that has to travel up to two hours north to Wilmington just to practice and two hours south to Charleston just to play games. Right now, our customers need a place to skate. They need a place where they can expose their kids to the sport of hockey. And depending on their time commitment to the sport, they may seek to play at a very high level one day. You may ask yourself, what is the competitive advantage of the Coastal Ice Palace? Well, what makes our business unique is that we would be the only hockey rink and youth organization in the Myrtle Beach area, with our closest competitor being hours away in Charleston. With this, we will have no competition and heavy foot traffic for all the players who play over at Coastal and any of the youth leagues that go all the way to Charleston to practice. In the future, after starting our primary location in the Myrtle Beach area, we could eventually expand into Conway, and we have Northerners moving here every year that love their hockey. Go Ice Palace. The startup capital required by the Coastal Ice Hockey Palace would be around two and a half million. We could work with investors, including Coastal Carolina University, to see if they would be interested in having a home ice arena to travel to. The money will be spent on roofing, construction, salaries for project management, site finishing, mechanical and electrical work, and other equipment. The different types of revenue revenue that will contribute to our success will be will mainly come from the youth hockey organization and partnerships with universities such as Coastal Carolina and other high schools, possibly starting a high school league and having a pro shop within our ice hockey rink and a concession stand.